I think definitely it was a great team performance. We really saw improvement with our ball movement and we played together really well to get open shots. So I think that motivates us together to continue with that and really focus on getting offensive looks that are good for our team, make sure everyone gets good shots and good looks for themselves as well as each other. So going forward, I think that'll be a plus for Virginia. Yeah, over the last couple of days we've been taking a look at Virginia and I think handling their pressure and their defensive traps and change-ups is going to be a major key for us. Obviously, once we break through that and handle that pressure, get, once again looking for our offensive looks and staying on track without getting pushed out of our own execution will be a major key. So look, our, our players, they listen, they fight. I'm just glad they finally got some success. They believed in each other, they believed in themselves. And unfortunately, sometimes when you don't get the results, that can erode their belief. And in this case, it really hasn't. And for them to get that win, it just really galvanizes that belief in what they're doing, trusting the process, uh, believing in themselves, and they just keep fighting. And to get over the top, again, I think it's a great confidence boost. Sure, Virginia's youth from last year has matured. They've got a bunch of freshmen and sophomores that are now some juniors and seniors. Um, they've got a 6'9 center. They've got good size across every single position. They're athletic. They defend extremely well. They're 4-0 in the ACC. Uh, you don't get that by just uh, by being a mediocre team. So uh, Coach Boyle coaches them very, very well. Uh, they shoot the ball from the perimeter, and they have an inside game. So, look, it's a challenge like every other game in the ACC, um, and we're excited to step up to it.